Hey guys, Hoshi Plays here, and I'm going to be talking about how I get gold in Moonlight Sculptor. So, first things first is you're going to want to either fish, or you're going to go to the exchange and buy every single fish you possibly can. From tiers common all the way to the rare tier. And I will show you the reason why you want to do that in a minute. What you're also going to need is you're going to need loot, which you can either farm or you can buy it off of this, uh, off the mar market as well. Which, as you can see here, you could buy, you could bid on a bunch of Yivy's tails for 94k. Um, another example would be Roshi's Club, Lapisha's Iron Sword, anything that's worth around less than 50k or so, or even even less than 100k can even be considered. Like these keys are all around 50 to 100k would be worth it still. And I've been making a lot of money off of this on this account. And just to show y'all why it can be so good, I'll open some of these up that I've saved up for y'all. So we got a Roaring Soul Stone, which is worth a lot. Um, some of those withering, withering things are worth a lot. The rest isn't that much, but Roaring Soul Stone by itself is worth about a million. And the blue tiers probably cost me about 200k. So I just made about 800k right now. Need another 10. I just got a 2 mil item. I just got another 1 mil item. So that's 3 mil. And I made about another... Say 10 of these cost about 1 mil. And I just got 3 mil. So I just made 2 mil off this. And I broke even on the last one. And then we'll use another 10. Shire's Curse, Kamusha's, Anna Anubis, Twisted Heart. So that's another... Three, four, five mil. I just made about. F I made at least five mil profit right now. I mean, I literally can't even do the math because it's uh, it's too much purple stuff for me to even understand. So we can go here. Shire's Curse. They're selling on this on my server for about a mil. Kamusha's Accessory selling for about a mil. Then. I don't remember if I got a tell or not, but I got two Anubis' heart, which are selling for about max, actually. So I don't know who put this up for 1.5 mil, but these are selling for max right now. These are selling for 2 mil each. So 2, 4, 5, 6. Just off of those. And if you think about it, you get 6 mil. I did about 30 pools. 30 of these are worth, like, maybe 100k each. So three mil, and then I just I can sell this loot for about five mil plus the blues, which I know this one's worth one mil, and I know some of these are worth about two hundred, three hundred k. I know this one's worth about like two hundred k. I'm not sure how much these are worth, but usually anything with an item price tag of eight thousand seven hundred fifty is worth a good chunk. And the reason why these are worth so much is because these are like the high tier bosses that are really hard for people to kill right now and grind and farm out. But they give you mass that you need in order to craft sculptures or craft weapons or other types of gear. So you can see there's none of these on the marketplace. And just because y'all are awesome, I'm going to X out that, use one of my daily, whatever they're called, just to see. See, it's about 200k each. And I got a bunch of them, so I can sell all those for about a mil. Or even if I sold them for men, I would still be getting 100k worth for each one. But, you're like, okay, well, you got 30 or whatever, that's cool, but that, you don't really seem to make too much profit. Well, you come over, I come over to my sculptures, and they're hard to click because I'm dumb and I set myself up wrong. But, if you see this, there's a Royal Shelf Sculptor. If I click it, you'll see Stealth, Steel Blacksmith, Seamstress, and Royal Shelf. And if you have all three of these, what you get is a chance for crafting great success plus 5%. I'm going to grab this. And what I can do is I can go to my set pieces and I can add this one, this last one I needed, and I get chance of crafting success plus 5%. And what you can do is, is you can take yourself and go over to, you're going to go to Cereborg, Cereborg Castle, 
in the bottom of the map you see it in you're going to want to teleport it in innkeeper Graham, i believe his name is and i'll be right back as soon as it's done loading all right it's loaded in so yeah uh in creeper grandman and you're going to want to go to the right side of the screen you're going to see this alchemy table and and i just prefer this alchemy table you can go to any alchemy table works go to material and you'll see lesser catalyst this is where you're going to use your common fish and you're just going to click the common button and you can select every single common fish you have click affirm click max and as you can see my chance for crafting sets is usually 10%, but since I completed the set, now it's 15%. I'll click confirm, and instead of getting just 100, because I did the crafting percent bonus, I actually get 119. And you'll just keep doing that until you use every single one of your fishes. So I'm getting 117 again. Confirm, max, and this is my last set. And I got 74. Then what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to click intermediate fish, and this is going to take your, this is going to take your quality ones. Click confirm, click max, click confirm. And then it gives me 27. I click this again. And now I'm going to use all the white ones that I use that I made lesser catalysts with. I'm going to make intermediate catalysts with those. So I'm going to click confirm. And that gives me 40 more greens. And then I'm going to take all of my rare fish that I made that, or that I caught. I'm going to click this and I'm going to turn those in to make even more of these catalysts, which get, gave me 19. And I'm going to come over here, and what I want to make is, I want to make a bunch of these rare magic crystallizations using, and unclick all these, you don't want to use just any old ones. But I'm going to use ones that aren't going to sell very good, or are not going to be worth very much. And this is also how I got a lot of my Calakia claws, that's 5-3 right now. So I click UV's Tail, I got Sharp Molar I can use, Von Hawk's kind of useless, all these keys, I don't really use them for anything. I have a lot of these Osborne Radiants, I'm not using them at all. Uh, Radiant Scale doesn't sell very high, Merv Wings. Um, what else can I use? All of these cores, all of these Harvey's Red Cloaks, I don't need any of that personally. Um, I don't know, I don't know, I have so much loot from so many mobs, I don't even know which ones are good anymore. And I'm just going to craft. 34 of these and as you can see I got 39 instead so I've already made profit well not technically but I've already made a bonus because I've already gotten 5 extra and that means that I've got an extra 500k at least or technically I've got an extra at least 250k if I got every single one and every single one's 50k or less but we'll keep going we'll keep going I can do one more I'll put a sword in there confirm this is just a regular one. Now I can do a couple of catalysts for these. Now if you remember the ring, the uh, Ripley tokens are worth about 1 mil each. So I use Ripley tokens. So I'm going to use both of those, put them in here. And that gave me, so this is very important. If you hit a bonus on heroic, when you're crafting a heroic crystallization, every time you hit a double on this, it's automatically guaranteed you're going to get and at least an extra one mil because they usually sell every single heroic item sells for about one mil. So just getting three off of that is really huge. And and uh, you can actually go higher if I had my sculptors at a higher tier. So mine are all at base gray. But if they were green, blue, purple, I would be getting a lot more crafting material or crafting bonus. So as you can see, we have 40 of our blues. And if you look at chance info, you'll see everything's about 2%. So the chance of you getting something good is about the same for every single one of these pieces. And if you come down here, you'll see that the, some of the purple stuff is about a 1% chance, which all the blue stuff is about 2%. And then you have really good ones, which are pretty rare, but they're 0 0.7, 0 0.6. And if we go through and we'll open some of these, got another 1 mil item, we got some 300k items, 300k for the eyeballs, another 2 mil item, a couple more 300k items, do another 10, we got another 1 mil item, a couple more 300k items, Here's another 10, we got a 5 mil item, another 2 mil item, 
And then we'll come over here to our purples. And I like to do these as singles. So I'll do a single. Shire's Curse. Not not great. Go open this up. Do another single. Ripley's Merciless Instinct. Really good. Open up another single. Ripley's Token. Not worth it. Do a single. And then we just lose a heart. Double their money. Confirm. Anubis Weapon Fragment. That's what you're looking for, really. Weapon Fragment or the heart. Because they pay for, to pay the most. And then... So if you look at the screen, you'll see Numa's weapon fragment is about 8.76%. And then a Adisha's murky orb is a little bit less than that. And they both pay around 5 mil. But if you're really, really, really lucky, you'll get this 0.001% chance to proc. And we're not going to have it. We're not going to have it happen already, though. That's, uh, I'm not that lucky. But I am pretty lucky. If you go and you look at our exchange, you'll see... I'm selling Anubis Weapon Fragments for about 6 to 7 mil each, depending on the day. Um, Adisha's Murky Orbs are selling for about 2.5. And these Tells are selling for about uh, 1 mil each. And I can go ahead and show you these Rings selling for about 1 mil each. These Shire's Curses are selling for about 1 mil each. Tells are selling for... Well, they dropped in price, it looks like, 700k. So, if you're going to roll, instead of doing Ripley token, Ripley's tokens are probably actually worth 1 mil right now. These tails might be the cheapest thing to buy right now. 735k. So, if you do do this, 735k for each one of those is probably more worth it. Um, as you can see, the hearts. These will sell for max. These will 100% sell for max. I've been selling them for max for about 4 or 5 days straight now. They'll get bought up pretty quickly. These, about 3 mil. Um, like I said, Ripley tokens are about 1 mil. So if I actually wanted to make good profit, instead of using those Ripley tokens, I should have used my tails. Then, like I said, Anubis Weapon Fragments are selling for about 5 to 7 mil, depending on the day. And depending on how many wells you have, probably these are selling for about 1.2. So if you want to make big profit, if you like, look at your service prices, you want to get the lowest tier heroic, you want to be buying the low, the cheapest possible fish. You want to be you want to be fishing in general. You want to be looking and seeing like these eyeballs sell for really ridiculous amounts right now. If I went up and put them up for 400k, they usually get bought. These tree trunks get bought for around the 150k mark or even more. I've seen them get bought out completely. I don't know. What, I don't even know what these are used for. You could sell these. These are worth about. You know, 200k each, 150k each, roughly. You're looking at this person selling it, and there's no other ones on the market at all. You got things like this that are not worth anything that you're going to be getting sometimes. But uh, this bracelet, for example, 600k. I could put it up for a little bit less. I I could put it up for minimum and still be making lots of profit. So that's basically how I've been making lots of money. I've been making millions of gold off of this way. I've been actually making about 15 to 20 mil overnight fishing on this account. And I don't know if I'm just really lucky or or if the way that they have the percentages are just so... I mean, the chance to get a blue is 2%, but the chance to get a purple is 1%. And when I do a 10 pool, I'm somehow hitting that 1%. I guess there's about five one percent, so I'm somehow hitting it one to two times every single time on a ten pool of my blues, and then on top of that, every time that I'm doing it, I'm getting doubles, and it's just stacking on top of each other. You're getting chances on chances on chances, and it's just RNG is just heavily weighted into your favor for some reason. And I, like I said, I just I don't know if that's because I'm very lucky right now, but this is definitely what's making me the most gold at the moment and i'm sharing it with y'all if it hopefully it works out for y'all if y'all want to give it a try and see i i'm only at 400k gold right now but i've literally been buying so much like i don't even know how to tell you that i've been buying so much stuff but i've been buying a lot of things from guild mates or from other people just to like get them a little extra bit spending cash if they can't sell something. This is probably the best best way to go.
Um, another thing is if you do do your fishing, you can sell these mineral waters for pretty hot too. Sell them for, if you, even if you sell them at minimum, 4,000 each, you know, you're getting about 500k just from those, just from fishing and chilling. But anybody who's wondering how I was making gold, that's how I've been doing it. And now that I have this, now that I have my crafting set complete, I will be planning on making a lot, 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 lot more gold. And I'm going to keep doing this. Um, it's very RNG based, but I feel like the RNG is in your favor, especially with the chances of you getting doubled. It's just really absurd. And I think these weapon fragments are eventually going to become a lot better because you're going to need them to make these high high end items or just really cool um, decorative items. Um, but I mean, that's it. That's That's what I've been doing. So guys, I just said that is ended the video, and I said that you know, sorry that I didn't sell my Anubises, but I actually just sold them and put my other ones up on the market. So they will sell. Uh, if you and as you can see, I am at eight million, eight point eight million now. So there you go. There's my proof. They do sell. It all sells. That's all. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, remember to leave a like and subscribe.